on line up in the crow's nest. I'm Eric Loy along with Kyle James. Hello, young man. Hello, Eric Loy. And we are getting ready for our first match of this episode. UWC Online, the corn-fed beast, Bo Sawyer, going up against Conrad. And we'll see how this goes. We'll see right away that Sawyer has got strength advantage, but Conrad right back up. Conrad's been away for a little while here in, here in UWC Online. Good to see him back. Oh, look, nice go behind. Oh, and, oh wow. takes him down. There you go. Nice work. A good and, technical prowess. And that just makes uh, that just makes Sawyer mad. A little bit of gloating, uh, probably not a best idea. But Conrad is a fellow that likes to get the momentum behind him. Does yeah, Conrad a very energetic? Almost hyperactive individual. And it, it can oh, work for him in the ring, but oh, a smile on oh, oh, Sawyer's face. Oh, Go so behind it, take down. Bo Sawyer doesn't care about the momentum. It's just, just sheer power. He's just throwing him around now. Here's how you do it. He just fires him down. Oh! Hunts him. What a kick! You know when Bo Sawyer smiles in the ring, I get this idea of crocodiles hunting. <laughs> Yeah, it's uh, I just don't don't think anybody wants to see that. No, it's a rather terrifying smile. Oh! And that's terrifying in itself. There is he smiling again. That's not good news for Connor. Conrad, oh, Conrad. latitude, pushing back. Gets a kick and how? Another chop for his trouble. That lifted him up off the mat. Conrad says do it again and he did. Sawyer throws Conrad into the ropes, comes off, misses. Conrad ducks, and oh! Cross body block, cross not happening. Body, but Sawyer just... He was ready. Powerful. Blistering. Backbreaker, two. Two count. And boy, so Sawyer says no, he kind of let off. That's not going to do it. He's got some more things in mind for Mr. Uh, Conrad. That vicious smile on both Sawyer as he grabs the beard of Conrad. You know... That hurts. Yeah. Punch right to the top of the head. Now, you think, think anyone Bo too... Sawyer would be sympathetic to that. Yeah, well, you, you still got a while before that beard comes in, I believe. Yeah, yeah, still some time. Been working on it for a while, hasn't, uh, hasn't panned out. Sawyer sets him up, what's he gonna do? Ooh. Pick him up? Just powering oh. him up. Just like a sack of potatoes. Nope. Oh. No, Conrad, Conrad slides off. Looking for that. Right for oh. It. oh, look at this. Nope. Wow, about broke the ring that time. Just powered up Conrad with one arm. Practically. Conrad trying to uh, uh, chain wrestle and, and counter the moves, but he's just not able to power past him. Conrad needs to use his speed and so yeah, Conrad, hard. Conrad needs to pick up the pace, but Bo Sawyer's just been putting a stop to that. Oh, oh no. This oh, no. This can't be good. A power bomb, a... a Oh, Ooh, oh looks, looks a backbreaker. Like oh, look at oh this. My. A gory special. Oh, I'll oh him no, off. Conrad looking to get Whoa, him. Oh, the nails knee. him with the knee. Nicely done. Setting in the three-point stance. Staggers it's into him. I thought corner. he was going to try and spear him coming off there. Looks like it, but oh, Conrad in the corner. Raining down the punches. He's not going very bit, quickly. A little, but, yeah, somewhat slow after this beating. Wait a second but here. There's an eight. Nine, Wait a second, folks. Ten. Coming out from the back is Cecil Cerveza. I don't know why Cecil Cerveza is out here. I don't know what he. Yeah, I don't know what he has to do with any anyone in this match. No, really. A punch to the top of the head. Right now, it's all going Conrad's way. Cerveza making his way to the ring. Why? Cecil's, yeah, Cecil standing ringside. I don't Conrad. think Conrad's where. Getting ready to go and drives in. Oh! Superman yeah, punch. Superman punch. Then. And now in comes Cerveza. Cecil in the ring. I, he's, he's, he's telling, telling Conrad, he's to, telling get Conrad out. to get out. Um, pushing he's Conrad got the microphone. Why? Well, he's not scheduled for a match. Of course. Of course. Of course, all you George County and boo me. Of course you. Why wouldn't you boo me? All I've been hearing day in and day out, Aaron Matthews 
this. Aaron Matthews that. Aaron Matthews in the locker room. Aaron Matthews in the back area. Aaron Matthews when I come out here. Aaron Matthews is nothing but a bona fide loser. Yeah, see? See? Y'all cheer Aaron. Y'all love Aaron. Y'all love Aaron. Everybody I'm in the ring with, I destroyed. I crippled Sam Knight. I destroyed Travis Weir. Everybody I'm in the ring with, I beat them down and they don't get up. But yet, the hot topic around here is Aaron Matthews. Are you an Aaron Matthews fan? Are you? Of course you are. No teeth, out of shape. Of course you're an Aaron Matthews fan. Are you an Aaron Matthews fan? You're sitting there wearing a mask. Just show how ugly you are. Of course, you're an Aaron Matthews fan. I'm getting this ring so I can embarrass you, Paul. Why? You're a punk. You're a loser. You barely kept Ooh. your job. Barely kept your job here. Barely won. And guess what you did when you left? You went right to the bar. Oh well, yeah, that showed uh, what kind of UWC competitor you are. I should be the one headlining everything. Hey, the thing you said, you should be, but you ain't. here and yell at them because they're Aaron Matthews fans? They come here for Aaron Matthews. I don't even know why you're in this ring with me. Last time you stepped in this ring, I almost broke your back on that floor. You have guts, kid. You have guts. I'm a former UWC champion. What are you? Oh, tag team champion. And you Three time tag team champion, Cecil. Three times! Three time tag team champion. Your tag team partners don't even like you. Hey, guess what? They don't, but Jokes Town does! Alright, here's a list. Your family don't like you. Your girlfriends don't like you. Your, your opponents, your tag team partners don't like you. All, all you got is them. You got two clicks. Out of shape, ugly, everybody in here. Okay. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Hold the phone, buddy. You're looking really mad. You need to calm down. Go get you about nine wa hot waters. Maybe a pork chop or two. All right, punk, why don't you put your money where your mouth is? Put my money where my mouth is, Cecil. I beat you year after year. I beat you up north, I beat you down south, I beat you to the west, I beat you to the east. And I'll be damned if I get beat Georgetown by you. Oh. Okay, looks like Aaron Mathis has accepted the challenge. Oh! Uh, he turned his back. That should never have happened. That is a bad idea. A man like Cecil Cerveza. And Cerveza's all over him. Oh, well, Matthew's is. fighting back though. And yeah, they're both going at it. Aaron's not one to stay down. No, he's not. Even when he should at times. Oh. Now off the ropes. Off the ropes, swing and a miss. Oh. Come back. Oh, and that super kick. kick. That super kick from Matthew. Cerveza should have known that was coming. Oh, wait, wait, what is Conrad doing? No, no, no. Wait. Conrad. Conrad looks like he, uh, I think Conrad's saying, I got Conrad's this. I think I got he's, this. uh, 
I think he's trying to go up against Cecil himself. But Aaron's saying no, this is Oh, oh and Conrad flattens him. Wow. And Conrad says, I got this. And Aaron says, business time, and Conrad flattens him. That huge right. And now oh, now I'm just away. on it. And Aaron Matthews may begin a, you know, turning away a little help there, and that's going to cost him. Oh, oh look out. That is, that is his, oh, and right on the, the head. Microphone, right the to the microphone. head. And Conrad's going to continue to pound him. No one's going to have to help him. Conrad just leaves him flat. Well, we started off with, with Bo Sawyer against Conrad. I don't... Oh, what is he doing? Conrad oh, here just feeding Aaron Matthews to Cecil now. Oh, no, here... Oh, roll the dice. Roll it. Just, just, you see the wrenching of the torso. Oh, and down he goes. Sick neck twist and Aaron. And that entire torso twisting on that one. And uh, there you go. Diane Conrad and well, now we see a new alliance it appears. I can't believe what we're seeing. Conrad and and Cecil Cerveza. Well, well. We started off with a match between Bo Sawyer and Conrad and ended up with a beatdown of Aaron Matthews. And maybe a new tag team, or maybe at least a teaming. Between Cecil Cerveza and Conrad, and Matthews help, Matthews, help out yeah, the Matthews ring. Matthews needing some help to get out of the ring, get to folks, the back. Uh, folks, we're going to take a break. Come back for more at UWC Online. It's going to get hot today. Grab a ice cold sun drop and show us how you drop it. Mm -hmm. Drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. And drop it. Because I got it going on. Drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. A first quench in citrus soda just dropped. Coast to coast. Sun drop. That's how you drop it. Drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. First off, let me start off by saying I hate each and every one of you idiots. I was sitting in the back listening to John Snow ramble. All I heard was you talking about the online title. Well, I don't care about the online title. I'm the heavyweight champion. That's who you should be talking about. You see, I stand here with the most prestigious belt in Central Illinois. And you see, over the last seven years, there's been one thing that's been constant in this company. And that constant has been me defeating each of those superstars in the back, whether it be Harker Dirge, Stephen Davis, Jason V. Doesn't matter who it is, I made a career over the last seven years for doing it. You can hear me just fine. Now, I'll tell you what. What I'm going to do to make the next match for the online title, I demand it be the heavyweight title. Infinite power. You see, Jones take a lot of punishment. Big kick. Nobody there. Just stated Mr. Eric Lake, no matter who it is. I'm gonna beat him one, two, three. Well, I'm going to take this opportunity while you're up here and, and let's do a let's do a bit of a um, well scouting report on these. I'd like to get in your head a little bit and see how you handle these. The first uh first competitor is gonna be 
Joey O'Reilly, one of the tag team champions. You've been in the ring with him several times. And what was the outcome of that? Pretty sure I beat him, didn't I? It's, uh, it would be a, an interesting matchup. Speed against power, certainly. Not taking away from your speed, but that's the way it would, it would probably come out. <laughs> your back in the match. I'm pretty sure I have a few people I may have to call in if you know what I mean. Yeah, that's happened before. I know what you're talking about. And we've got uh, we've got ourselves a tag team match here, Mr. Reed. And we've got that would certainly benefit you. Have somebody win but have injuries uh, beside that would make it uh, something but it's something I something I've got to give you credit for. I, I not a fan of how you've gotten the title, but since then, it's been it's been uh, just destruction after destruction for you. I mean, you've really I, you really come on strong since getting that belt back. You had had it a long time ago, but mm -hmm. really since then, it's it's been uh, um, an even uh, higher level of confidence for you, and uh, that that belt does you. Does you well. Looks good on me, doesn't it? I think it does you well as far as co competition is concerned. As we see, Joey O'Reilly working against Mark Vandy, trying to reverse. Randy blocks it. And Vandy, Vandy with that length, I imagine it'll make him very hard to, to get into the ring because even if you have him down, he's closer to the ropes than anybody. You see, if I was Mark Vandy, what I would be doing is taking out Joey O'Reilly's legs, take out the high flyer's leg. What's he got to do to move? Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. But with this height, he also has a lot of leverage advantage. Now he's trying to bring him back for a double team, and Tornado Jones says no. I have to question that for Jones. You want to get in there and you want to compete, you got to compete. And good solid takedown. The dynamics of a of a three-way match is very tough to get a pinball in. There's always one person that can, that's out there trying to come in and break things up. Now into the corner. And Vandy is wants to make the tag. Jones is walking away from him. 
Going back to what you said, I think in the triple threat match, you always have to have the eyes in the back of your head. You don't know where it's come from. Left, right, up, down. It's hard to get an alliance in the ring. Now he tags out to Castle, so. While I understand the emotions behind this, if you want to win and go on, you have to get in there and do it. You have to go there and get friend, foe, tag team partner, what have you. This is something that you would have absolutely no trouble doing. Not at all. I have to drive with determination every time I step in that ring to be to show why I am the best. And look at this, Castle. <laughs> Castle being uh, Alex Castle makes the tag <laughs> and brings an O'Reilly. O'Reilly says, "Oh, want to tag." No, Castle says, "No, nah, not happening." No need for that funny business here. See, you got to be straightforward. Get some. No, oh, and Vandy's going away too. Well. I hate to now be the, show what these two are made of. I have to be the bearer of bad news, gentlemen, but you have to wrestle. Go in there and do it. Let's see a little hunger from these guys. See if they want see if they want a shot at the at the champ. That's right. And the two lock up. And this is gonna be if these two really go out at full force, uh, we're gonna need extra eyes to watch them go back and forth. Because they'll be all over the place. Shoulder block and down goes O'Reilly. Jones comes up, O'Reilly up and over, and oh, stands up, takes him down. Tornado Jones gets the advantage there, up and monkey flip. O'Reilly rolls on his way through, comes back, oh, and pulls his punch. You can't do that, you have to have a killer instinct. You oh, look at no that. No matter who it is. Ha. Castle smacks him in, oh, O'Reilly tags. Smacks him and tags him in. That's not going to get you a title shot. And, you know, Castle is like a, you know, a piranha in there. He'll, he will not take any quarter. But he will take your quarter. I'll take the quarter and send it back to him. Yeah. Reversal into the ropes. Castle gets hit with the knee by Vandy. And now up and over goes Jones. Jones hangs on. Hits with the shoulder block. Yells at Vandy. Goes head first. And going for the pin. The two. No kick out. Castle has uh, the, the uh, amazing ability to slither his way out of a lot of things, though. And I. Headbutt. And that's one of Vandy's trademark moves, that gigantic cranium of his. Looks just as dumb with a stupid beard on his face. Well, and you know, I like the cool guys get to have beards. He looks like the Amish, and I hate the Amish. You hate a lot of things. I do. Vandy comes in and nails his car. And he was a this is a beautiful tactics by Mark Vandy here. Do what you got to do to get the win. It's all about getting that shot at the title. Yeah. I mean, Vandy. he'll come up he'll come up short, but... Now it's this match first. He's not going to get to you unless he wins this match. And... Tags in O'Reilly. Uh, tags in Tornado Jones. I'm getting all mixed up with this. This is a tough one to call. They both look like hobbits. I don't know. And he pushes Vandy off. And... It, And being a little too kind, I think, right now. Coming off the rope, trying to get some momentum up and over again. And this time he kicks him on the way in. Oh, straight down DDT. And there's that, there's that plain old meme from Castle. Castle's got to make his way to his corner and get the tag to O'Reilly. That's just tough to say. I mean, after all these athletes have been through. Now, Tornado Jones making his way to the other corner to tag Vandy, and he does make the tag. Castle says no. And Vandy runs into this. That's what you got to do. You don't put trust in somebody else. You put, the, you put it on yourself. And I would agree with you, but maybe he's in the shape we needed to get out of there, especially with Vandy coming in and fresh. And Vandy bringing him up. Rakes that across the face a second time. Castle and Vandy drag it into the corner. Now, Vandy pulls away and now Dupree working him over. And he's got to take advantage of it with Dupree because his partner won't help. 
Not condoning it. You do what it. you got to do to win. Not condoning it, but it's there. You, if you want to win, you got to do what it takes. And he tags in. This has been very tough to get any momentum going. And uh, Right now it seems like Mark Bendis got the momentum by himself. Maybe he's the, the shiny star of these, uh, I don't even know what to call them. Superstars, of which you are the champion. That puts you... You call them falling stars because they're going straight to the ground. Well, well, the two of them are going up against you. I'm the top of the mountain. But right now, the ground. I am, I'm not at all positive that two of these athletes are, have got their hearts in it. And that will be something that you will take advantage of. I certainly will. You don't need heart, you need tactics. Whether they be questionable or not. Tactics prove winners. And a knee to the side of the head. Castle coming off. Tornado Jones follows him. Ooh, ouch. Double knee now. Jones coming up, up, over the top, caught. <laughs> Fireman's carry. Yes. Drops him right into that knee and down he goes. That's what it takes. You may take one mistake. That's all it takes from these high flyers. One mistake, and I will capitalize on each and every one of their mistakes. Uh, if if a high flyer misses, you catch him and smash him. That's done. It's bashing. That's what I do best. I don't. I don't see how anybody could get up from that. Whether they're a high flyer or why don't you just ask Stephen Davis? He hasn't even been here since he wrestled me. Well, that was a heck of a match, and you doubt you get a bit. oh attack. Castle flipped him off, but got the tag anyway. Riley comes in, nails, nails him with that kick. Now it's O'Reilly, who is by far the freshest man in that ring. Up and over, backflip, comes off, bang. Runs right into All the All that fancy stuff ain't gonna get you nowhere. Down he goes, might get the win. Cover, one, two, no. Randy kicks out. Swinging a miss, Vandy throws him up and over, wow! One, two, and oh, no, no, no! Castle comes in and makes the save, drags him back to the corner and makes the tag. Well, that's one you way see, to that's, that's, that's what you gotta do, get the job done. No, and he took his eye off of Tornado Jones, though. And Jones, come back as that drop kick again, and Castle's down. Castle's lost his partner, now he's in trouble. And, ooh, a stomp, that's pretty vicious. Cover, one, two, whoa, whoa, oh, oh, Vandy. Vandy thought for sure they had it there. Now he's getting on his partner. Vandy just having too much. And he's taking him back in the corner and yeah, just greeting him the riot act. Good. O'Reilly thrown into Jones and Castle disposes of O'Reilly. Hit to the boot. Double underhook. Down he goes. Cover. One, two, and there are the two men you're going to be facing. My next two victims come to heat is on because the results always give me the same and they said they're for a constant thing in this cup. Well, I better say this, shit, man. You've certainly proven that you are a champion. You put your belt up on the line now against well, young man and Joey O'Reilly that's going to be flying around and another man who you're going to need those extra eyes for an Alex Castle. Blake Reed, we thank him coming up for his scouting report. It's going to be Blake Reed here in a couple weeks going up against Joey O'Reilly and Alex Castle for the UWC Championship. That's going to do it for UWC Online.